It's time for the talking to stop and the fighting to start. This should be good. I'm Todd Grisham. Next to me is Johnny Nelson. Todd, always a pleasure to work with you. Always a pleasure. It's time for our tale of the tape. This fight in the cruiserweight division. Maximum poundage, 200. There is no joke about this. Someone is going to get hurt. The other is going to get embarrassed. Let's make sure they measure up well. From the United States of America. From the United Kingdom. This is going to be one hell of a fight. So now let's go into the ring for the official introductions. Here's the classy Jimmy Lennon Jr. This bout is scheduled for eight rounds of boxing. In the red corner from the United States of America. Wearing the white trunks, trimmed with orange. Hiding out of the blue corner from the United Kingdom. Wearing the white trunks, trimmed with white. All the talking has been done. It's time to start doing the walking. Todd, I'm going to stay here till the end of the night. Because if you're a fight fan like me, this is what I live for. Thousands of fans here in attendance tonight, but when the bell rings, there will only be two that we're talking about. They ring the bell, and here we go. He's going to loosen things up here. Let's see how he does with this fancy footwork. Nice counter. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. These two have been going at it on social media, and now finally, they're about to go at it in the ring. You have some fighters that are big show, big arena fighters, and they bask in this. They love this. They are born for this. You have other fighters where this will be like the rabbit in the headlights. Nobody home with that hook. Halfway through the round, and man, these two are going at it. Continues to touch him up. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now, this fight will say, you know what? I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them. More than happy. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Do you believe what we're seeing? That punch has been his best weapon all fight long. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Hoping for an all-action slugfest. This fight has been very one-sided. What are we going to have in this round? Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. This fighter has been described as a swarmer, that fighter who attempts to overwhelm their opponent by applying constant pressure. A swarmer, a good swarmer, will get inside you like a, like a bee, like a bee just pickpocketing and stinging you wherever you leave yourself open. A swarmer is the worst kind of fight to fight. Beautiful counter shot. Good punch. Couldn't land that jab. And we 
may see a stoppage here. And they're down. It looks like this one's going to be over. When you get hit with a body shot like this, there's nothing you can do. Watch it again in slow motion. You're right, Todd. What a shot. Referee says we will fight on. Not sure about this one. He's up, but for, for how long? Look at her. On the heels. Look at her. It's not there. There's no defense. The eyes are glazed. It just takes one more clear shot. A clean one. And he's out. Not the best of rounds with 10 seconds to go. A chance to make history. And there's the bell to start the round. Let's see how he bounces back here after getting dropped in the last round. What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to mental strength and preparation. It's how you are going to deal with this. Just missed with that hook. Your footwork has to be on point when you're fighting a swarmer. If it's not, you're going to get caught in the corner and beaten up. Oh, man, you've got a swarm in your face. You've got to try and push him off, make him go into the rope. You've got to sometimes fight fire with fire. Hit him low on the blind side of the referee. Get him angry. Nice counter shot. This has been a very competitive round as we reach the midway point. That uppercut misses. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. They're always looking for that KO, and we could see an upset right here. How did they... And they got caught! Knocked down hard. I'm not sure that they're going to be able to get back on their feet here as the referee continues the count. That body shot right there paralyzed him and won him the fight. Even I've got to see that again. Where did that come from? So it's onward and upward after another knockout win here. Accuracy, power, punch, perfect. That must hurt.